Hello y'all, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> I was like trying to be like sexy for like half a second and then I was like, oh, okay, this is just really weird. So I'm just gonna do my thing, sorry. I'm kind of like chilling in the corner because the lighting's weird, but anyway. So today we're gonna be doing an update for my Snow White and the Seven Pants. And this one's gonna be really exciting because this is gonna be our second update. I know I'm late, I know I'm late. Um, but you know what, this is just so exciting for me because this is an all makeup project. We've got, I think, until the ninth month, so it's uh, ending in September. September is my birthday. And uh, it's just really exciting. They kinda, I'm gonna pull these products over here because they're sitting in the sun. I'm sorry for those of you that don't appreciate my accents, but uh, I'm gonna stop now. So, you're welcome. So, I'm gonna try to remember all these dwarfs' names, but I might get some wrong. So, I'll do the ones I can remember first, and hopefully we'll think of them all by the end of this video. So, oh, and by the way, just so you're excited, all of these product products are makeup, except for one. So, Get super excited because I know makeup products are the most fun to watch. So, ow, oh, I feel like I'm getting like a little bit of a sty in my eye or something. I don't know. It's kind of tender. Ah, uh, ah. Okay. Product number uno. This is for the dwarf Sneezy. I chose, oh, by the way, in my intro, I explained like why I chose each of these products and never gave a backstory on them. So go watch that if you're wanting to know that. But I'm going to try to keep this video pretty short and sweet. And do this quickly because the sun's going down and I know that y'all probably like watching shorter videos rather than longer videos so I'm gonna try to do it quickly but um a uh, Mario Badescu oh you can't even see it huh Mario Badescu of rose water spray and at the last update I was uh, up here and now I'm here and I do have until the September to finish this so I'm not super worried about it um, I haven't been wearing makeup as much as I normally do, and so I'm surprised that there's not more prog progress than that, if, if we're being honest, because I do use this pretty much anytime I'm, like, just doing casual makeup, which is more than not, you know? So, kind of disappointed in this one. Should have thought I would have had more progress, but whatever. So, for the second dwarf is Happy, and for Happy, I chose two foundations, and I chose my uh, Maybelline Super Stay which was full at the last update. And now, I've, I don't know if you can see this black line, I'm about right there. Um, I've used this, I don't really know. I think there was probably m more space in it than I thought last time, but I think like, cause I think I only used this like two or three times. But anyway, um, my goal is to use this about halfway um, and, that, and about the, this one about halfway. And I honestly, I've used this like twice since the last update and my goal is this one halfway and I can't see any like progress. Um, I don't know if the bottle's just coated or like there's just like, it's still super full, who knows? So um, hopefully at the next update, it'll be settled enough to where I'll be able to like at least mark a line. So that was the second dwarf, which was happy. And the next, um, dwarf I'm gonna discuss because I remember its name is Doc and that was the one non-makeup product I have and it was a lotion I said I wasn't gonna start on it until I finished the lotion that I'm currently doing and I haven't even started on it so I'm not gonna show it and I also don't have it with me so it's just completely full don't worry you're not missing out on anything I haven't used it um bashful is another one of them and um the product for that one is you're supposed to pick like a blush or a blush colored product. But anyway, I chose um, this Stila convertible color and it is, my goal is to hit, it, it's actually, I just use it on my lips, but my goal is to hit pan in three of these pans. Um, I know we're only in the first update of this, so I've got plenty of time, but I think these two are still pretty full. Um, I would say the most usage is on this one, which I'm guessing is in the shade Lilium. And then I'd say the second most used is this one and this is the third most used. So I think that these three are the most likely to um, to get uh, used up or get hit pan first. And so after I, if I hit 
pan on on these three within like the first three months or so of this project then I'll expand my goal to wanting more pan but um the goal the like original goal is just to hit pan on three of them and I think that's pretty like a reasonable goal and um yeah so that's that on that the next um product is for you know what I don't honestly remember the names of the dwarf so I'm gonna go look that up quick and then um okay so it. sleepy dopey and grumpy are the one the three that I have left to go over and um for sleepy I'm pretty sure it's this one um which is a product that you're comfortable panning or that's like almost used up and um I picked this because there's not very much left in it it's a brow pencil I have been using it pretty much every time I do my makeup um at the last update I was I don't know if you can see those lines but I've only made like a tiny bit of progress since the last update um but since it's so thick it like goes a pretty long way um this is it's actually all the way rolled up so that's all that's left right now but um and then that's the progress line but I think you know I am comfortable painting this because this project's over in September and I think this should definitely be used up by September um Okay, so that was Sleepy, and then we have Grumpy. Grumpy was a love-hate product, and for that, I picked this All May Smart Shade. And it used to be a hate product because I had no use for it, but now it's a love product because I've found a use for it, and I explained all that in my last video, but I have been loving using this product. And um, anyway, you can't see a vis visible like line difference of the progress, but I have been using it almost every time I do my makeup. Um, so I think... Even if I can't finish it, I'll be happy if, like, this line is cut in half at the end of this project. And because I've had this since, like, at least junior high, if not sooner. So this is super old, and um, I'll be happy to get it out of my collection just because of the age, even though I like the product. Um, and then the last product, um, gosh, I forgot the other dwarf's name. Uh, I'm so bad. I guess... So there was Sleepy Dopey and Grumpy left, and I don't really know which of these products goes with which because I don't have the list in front of me, but just know that one of whatever. So whatever is the one that I haven't talked about is the Stila um, Glitter and Glows, and I don't I think I've used the gold one once since my last update, so none of these have, neither of these have progress on them really. I've used it, but I don't know if you can tell, but there's like visible wear in this. It's just so dry, like the product itself. Like when I take the wand out, it's like literally just gets specks. And I can see through this, like there's like quite a bit of light showing. Um, but I've heard some people say that you can put uh, eye drops in this to like revive it or whatever, but I don't wanna revive it if I'm not gonna use it that much, so. I mostly just put it in this project so that I could get more use out of it. These two are already pretty much, like, dried up. But I do, like, like use them just, like, as, like, huh? like, 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 like. I'm just emphasizing the lines because I'm annoying myself. But um, just, like, a very, like, light dusting of glitter. And so I do still use them for this. I said in my last thing that I would probably throw them away if I didn't have them all used up by the end. But I kind of change my mind because even if like I can't get like an op do you call that opaque when it's like sh pretty showing all the way through but even if I can't get like full coverage glitter I enjoy having it just for the light sparkle so I'm hoping to get these like pretty much gone but if not I might not throw them away haven't decided so anyway that's the end of the update so it's been a it's been it's only seven products so it's a pretty quick little tiny project but i hope you enjoyed it and thanks for watching and please watch my other videos like comment and subscribe and i don't i want to emphasize that i think this project's really fun and i don't know why more people aren't watching it i think because maybe like not as many people are doing it so not as many people watch it but i think it's a fun project i know uh sandra narajo is doing this project and she's fun to watch i can't think of any off the top of my head other one people that I watch that are doing this project, but anyway, you should go watch her too. Bye!